Michael, can you tell me the story that helped you develop your sales philosophy? What helped me develop that philosophy, Allison, was years ago we had a business in the automotive industry. We made used cars look like new. We were at a stage where we wanted to sell, had some offers, and decided we wanted to see if we could build that up a little more for a better offer. Right about that time was when the economy crashed and the auto industry really tanked. We saw our business go down by about 30%. We saw our dealerships not only struggle, but you couldn't buy a Lincoln Mercury in Northern California. All those dealerships literally went out of business. And by using this philosophy, what ended up happening was we actually, over the course of the next year, increased our revenue by over 40%. We increased our profits by over 70%. And we actually sold our business, even during that economy, for 70% more than the top offer we had a year earlier. The way it worked was, instead of trying to sell, and our customer was the used car manager, someone who most people don't want to deal with on a regular basis. Shrewd negotiators, not people you would typically have an open conversation and collaboration with. But we sat down with them and said, okay, your business is struggling. Our business is struggling. How can we work together to help each other? And through those conversations, we completely changed our business model. They helped us understand how we could best serve them. And we redefined who we were as a company. And by doing so and changing that model, we grew our business significantly. If we kept trying to sell and convince them they needed our product and our offerings during that time, we would probably have gone out of business. But by collaborating, by sitting side by side, by gaining an understanding of how we could best work together, we developed a brand new business that was highly successful and helped them dramatically and allowed us to sell our business for significantly more than what we got a year earlier.